again this is a, a no-brainer the euro swiss is absolutely a no-brainer it is closed the week at 127.66 so right now i will be buying it but if it takes two ticks below the structure point i'm going to go short so that i'm what i'm going to do i'm going to put my short entry 127 64 again be reasonable give it a few pips or something i mean just but it's such an important point this is where we have to take it into consideration 64 and it is also my structure short point yeah you have a good point there charles If we have time, I'll do it. I mean, let's let's finish because the Euro Swiss is kind of easy. So, if we have time, I'll do the Euro Aussie too. This is a structural technical point, so I will buy the Euro Swiss above one twenty eight twenty eight. Make it one twenty eight thirty and i'll place my stop below 128 no i don't have time has it uh, it's we're already uh, we did uh, if i finish early before two o'clock because i have to up i have to have i need to upload the stuff otherwise if it's going to be uh, i'll try long stop uh 127.91 okay so uh the euro swiss is we're going to buy the euro swiss above 128.30 and if we do our structure to the long side is 132.28 and i'm going to place my long stop at 127.90 so i'm risking about 40 pips on that trade my short point is the 127.64 and if I go short be that my structure short is the 127.64 and it is also my short stop remember we are now sitting at 127.66 or I mean the closing price is 127 what is it 127.66 so we're basically we're two or three pips above our selling point which makes it easy so but just be patient and make sure it goes below it give it 10 15 pips give it be reasonable about the uh, the entry of the trade but if it breaks below these three numbers it is it should give us a good decent move to the downside all right that